as you kind of move up um, in the organization of UGBC, um, a lot of it um, becomes a directing people's passion instead of you know directing your own passion. So facilitating change um, while other people are kind of the movers and shakers of that, um, and it's been really rewarding to help and aid in that process uh, and aid in that change. I I knew some very awesome mentors when I was uh, a freshman, and uh, to be able to do that for other people and to have people look up to you and um, kind of show people the ropes of Boston College and how to be how to be and live their identities fully is uh, something that's been immensely important to me and I think uh, within my role as VPDI um, it's an important aspect of that. Regardless of any advocacy work there's always going to be friction and you know roadblocks that uh, come you know through um, through any kind of relationship um, and uh, working relationship with the administration and uh, with those in power and things like that. And so um, coming at those roadblocks, I think it's just been very important to uh, work on a collaborative spirit and work to continue um, looking into the future and building uh, minor steps along the way. I have a vision of myself as, you know, becoming like a hero um, and, you know, I've worked, you know, a lot to involve myself in activities that I consider um, heroic and important to, you know, the betterment of the world and to being, you know, a leader for others and for being kind of a mentor for others as well. And so, you know, whether it's been in ROTC or UGBC, I've been, I've been here um, and I work really hard to just create that atmosphere of, you know, collaboration, cooperation, and community and development. I will definitely be looking forward to being involved in other organizations that, um, you know, outside of BC that um, kind of follow the values that I've, you know, settled here and work on the same issues that I've uh, worked here at BC.